hello my crafty friends and today I am sharing some happy mail that I received actually a couple of um a couple of hours ago <laughs> it just came in the mailbox so um I was like I can't wait to you know open it up and get in there it's from a um Christmas mini tag album swap that I um did And here's the packaging. It's from my new friend, Rita. Hey, Rita. <laughs> Thank you so much for the um, album. I haven't opened it yet, but you know, just thank you in advance. <laughs> so let's get this open. I'm gonna slide that off. The ribbon is so pretty. You guys know I'm being me, trying not to Tear the stuff. <laughs> this paper is so pretty. I like. I love the full accents. That's really nice. Really, really nice. I'm just gonna slide this little washi tape off. It has a little angel on the front. This is so cute. Oh my gosh, did she make this? It's beautiful. So as you can see, it's a little paper angel. This is really nice. And some very intricate die cuts. These are so pretty. It looks like lace. They have these. And I don't know if it's showing up, but this is like a pearl. I don't know, it has like a pearl um, finish on it. That is so that is so pretty, and I love this. I need to ask her um, what die cut that's from. That's really pretty too. Here's the front. It has a star. It says "Deck the Halls" <laughs> for you. It's cute. And I'll do, I'll flip it like this and then I'll come back and do the other side. <laughs> so this is really cute. I can put a photo here. Um, and this is wishing you a wonderful Christmas. That's really cute. And I can add photos on the back also. Look at this. This is so cute. I love this. Um... I think that actually might be a um a doily, which would be the first for me because I usually don't like doilies, but I like it like this. This is beautiful. I love that with the little snowman. <laughs> Has Merry Christmas. I love the dyes that she used. It's um it's a lot of texture to it. I don't know, or should I say, yeah, I would say texture because it's the way the paper is layered and like this paper just has like, um, let's see if I can zoom in. Not far. <laughs> the paper just has a really pretty texture to it. This is so cute. I think I already know what I'm going to use this mini album for. I think I'm going to use it for, um, for last year's, um, I think it was last year or either the year before last, we took a couple of the girls um, in my mentee group to the Festival of Trees. So I think I might use this to um, keep all of their pictures in because I have the pictures. I keep saying I'm going to do an album for them and I haven't got around to it. So I think this just made my job a lot easier. This is so cute with the little buck. <laughs> and I love this snowflake. This is adorable. And this is um, like a die cut for words. It's ho, 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 Noel, peace, believe, holidays. This is so cute. And it's in the shape of a Christmas tree. I love that. That is so adorable. <laughs> it's cute. No snow. Uh, snow doubt about it. <laughs> That's cute. I like the little mittens. Unfortunately, it doesn't snow here, so no 
white Christmases. Like, it, you know, it's Georgia. If anything, we might get ice every now and then and the whole city shut down. And it's not fun at all. So, yeah, if you can hear that noise in the background, that is my dog whining about something. I think she wants my um, bottle, uh, the bottle top off my drink. Which she has a addiction for like playing with bottles. So I think that's why she's whining in the background. <laughs> but then it has some candy canes, which is super cute. And then it has the end of the um, album. And you can see her signature on here, heartfelt and handmade by Rita. And that is really cute to um, add this on the back or like just having a stamp um, for your stuff. I never stamp any of my things or like put my, you know, put my signature on it, which, you know, I need to do that because, yeah, I just need to do that. <laughs> but this is so cute. I can't wait to add my photos and I'm, I'm going to try to um, get around to adding photos on here and then coming back on and showing how I decorated uh, my album because this is too cute. And then she has a um, gold jump ring with uh, some ribbon around it, which the ribbon is so cute. And I need to find a, I've never seen a gold jump ring um, when I'm, oh, and I didn't even see this. Oh, wow. It has some um, charms on here. It's cute. I love this one, Made with Love. And it has a star and a, um, uh, what you got, these tassels? I don't know, a jewel, like a jewel ornament. That's cute. Love it. Then, <laughs> she went a step above and beyond and she included um, a note and a few extras. That's really cool. And this is so sweet. Like, thank you so much. I mean, something she really didn't have to do. Oh, that's cute. I love this bow. I can never make them that small. Like, my the bow maker I use is kind of big. It makes them kind of big. I love this. And it's like some little words that um, she made. And another cute little bow. Okay. I need to cut my nails down. <laughs> I'm having the hardest time picking stuff up. And look at this cute little owl. I love owls. I love birds in general. If you guys, if this is your first time watching like one of my videos, you will know, uh, well, you just heard me say it, but you know, you won't know about my obsession with birds. But if you've been here for a while, you know how I love birds, but they don't love me back. <laughs> this is a cute little turtle. This make me thinking about, um, this make me think about the Finding Nemo movie with the, with all the turtles. I don't know. That's cute. I love that. I got a stamp set that would look really pretty with then have a bumblebee and a little um, stamp that says hello. A cute little pink flamingo and some more little words. She included some tag, a tag and some little trees, a bow, a sled, that's cute, and a little baby elephant. <laughs> and he's so adorable. <laughs> I like elephants too. <laughs> and it says just a little about me. And I don't know if she wants me to read, you know, um, like all her information. So I'm not, but I'll just give you like, um, like an overview of what this says. It talks about, um, like her family, um, what she, what her occupation was. She's retired. And I, I can tell this, she loves to quilt, sew, crochet, um, Paper crafts, um, she crochets purses. That's that's pretty awesome. Um, and she has nine um, grandchildren. That's amazing. That's a blessing. <laughs> and she also included like some of her favorite things, coffee, anything lemon. Me too. I love lemon. <laughs> I love lemon flavored like sweets, um, fruits. Chinese food, uh, I like Chinese food too, but yeah, she has in parentheses, not that often. <laughs> I know, right? The fried rice, it will pack on the pounds. <laughs> uh, 
Um, she has some of her favorite colors. Um, like her favorite, like I guess, style of crafting is shabby sheet. That's really cute. Um, currently in two groups for Bible journaling and art journaling. I never got into Bible journaling. Um, I don't know. It's just like I was. I guess I was raised in like a traditional, um, like very very strict traditional uh, Christian house and. Like, with my big mama, you didn't touch the Bible unless you was reading it. <laughs> and you didn't write in it at all. Like, you know, she the only thing only thing that was written in the Bible was, like, the, um, the family tree. So, I don't know. I, I think to get into Bible journaling, that's, like, one, uh, that's one thing I would have to get over. Like, actually, like, coloring or writing in the Bible. I don't know, so. But I do like art journaling. <laughs> and um, what else? I don't want this this video to go too long, but I want you guys to you know learn a little bit about Rita. Um, uh, she loves to make mini albums. Me too. <laughs> to me, mini albums are so fun to make, and I'm gonna you know just gonna put it out there. I think I like making mini albums more so. Then I like making my um like 12 by 12 layouts. So I think I probably will be like changing things up a little bit because um I don't know, I just like mini albums. I, and I like um smaller size um I like smaller size scrapbook layouts and stuff. Mainly because the pictures I usually don't print out pictures above four by six. And I think to me, I just like the way they look on a smaller um, format than 12 by 12. So yay. This is my package um, from Miss Rita. Thank you so much, Rita.